Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is DJ, welcome back to Resurrection. Um, this is update 1.2. I think I've added basically everything to my book. Um, but yo, yeah, this is the new update that is come for the forest. 2.0 if you want to call it that. I don't really want to call it that, but you can if you want. Um, we're actually going to do this. Forgot to do this the other time. Get rid of this tree. Because everyone is complaining about it, and it is very annoying when I'm over here. I just really, really get mad by just how garbage the placement is and everything, so I'm going to take it away. Um, so first, there's going to be a couple new things added soon. Now you can actually traverse this area a little bit. Uh, I should say a little bit better. Um... So, basically, there's going to be a couple new things. There's already, wait, actually, ooh. Gotta add, added, wait. Ching, added. And then whatever that is. Also added a new item. Suck if I get that wrong. Alright. I think I got it right. I keep messing up this word so much. Yep. I'm used to spelling other things that have... <sighs> shields. I put the E before the I. I do this all the time. I don't know what word like has an E before an I. Or an I, whatever. Or an I before an E, whatever. You know what I'm saying. I can't. I woke up super early today. Played Skyrim, and that was about it. But, uh, yeah. Obviously, we played some of this today, but. New stuff? Um. So I guess let's get to it. Obviously fixed chests around the map. I added a crap ton of, I guess it's only like five or so um, things. It's sharpness, actually we have some protection, power, and like uh, fire aspect one. There's one in here, flame, that's old. Which one, I think it was in this one. Yeah, protection. Um, but really just put all throughout, kind of standard stuff. So, next is going to be really, really big for the game. And I feel like this is going to be huge for changing up the game itself. So, when you came in here, there's a, a couple new things. Nothing's really new about the inside except this. Have that, which we'll talk about right here. Um, and I honestly thought you could put these under signs. You know what? I just got to... Nope, alright. So I don't know how I did that in the other game, or in the forest. But, um, yeah. Now, this is the entire uh, workshop, or forge, or whatever you want to call it, is, um. Actually, this is what I wanted to do. Get these little ideas every once in a while. just add those kind of things it makes it look a lot better but um now this entire area here is a uh, material based or crafting based so instead of a bunch of armor and everything now this has a diamond iron ingots sticks and stuff like that and it also has protection it still has the skull forger but uh yeah and once when you know you wanted to go back here get this It is now more material based as well. You could make a diamond sword and an iron sword for your friend if you're doing uh, teams of two. I honestly today was one of the best days I've had for a while. It was hilariously fun. There is always those times where things just get weird. I deleted Rainbow. Now I'm getting it back again because of 
something that is really stupid and shouldn't even be exploited, but it's... Uh, there was a hacker and we had, like, an entire theory around, I don't know, kind of a debate, if you will. Um, but that's besides the point. I played Skyrim. We've played an, an amazing round of the OG Forest uh, in 1.7 with Elytra's, and it was... I would just watch the video, but anyway, uh, yeah, this is the entire, this is going to get, we're going to have um, an entire forge area, like an area that is kind of based around this building. We're going to have areas going that way and everything, so it's going to be really cool. Next is, ooh, we have um, things at this building, so I want to try to make this a bit less like... I don't know. That just seems good to me. But, uh, where did all the stuff go that was in here? That Maybe this is all, but... Sharpness 2, that's really good. Um, it's in here. Huh. Um, but, um, yeah. Nothing's really new in here. But, up here, and I'm going to, going to tell you. This took some interesting thoughts. See what I'm doing right here? We're gonna keep that there. Can't get in from here, can you? No. Wait, what if I remove that? Nope. Alright, so... We're gonna add this around here, so even if you're on the trees, you can't get in. Because, special little exploit that I have here, I, I like using that word now, exploit, I don't know. All that doesn't attach. Um, just give me some of this. Actually, let's just do that. Not mean to do that. Bam, so now you can't get in at all. Um, so, there's this chest up here. Actually, bam. So there's no way of you getting, I guess if you, Um, there's no way of attaching anything to that. That's just kind of like... Uh, Alright. Well, that's that's fine. But, now, you're probably wondering why that's like that. You cannot jump up here. You can use a leaping potion. I don't think there is any. But, the exploit here is that you gotta use your the things around you. So, most of the time, if you're here, I just kind of shoot it off to you. Bam. And you just go in. This is a new, I'm going to call these pinnacle weapons, or named weapons, or mo more important weapons. Weapons of more importance. Uh, which is the Flame Digger. This is actually kind of desirable, because it does more than a wooden sword. Just slightly. Has nice on breaking, and fire aspect. So that's cool, I guess. Does have sharpness too, which, the thing, the problem is here, let me, let me show you. Um, I think this goes up to three, so, yep, so difference between these, which one's better, you could stick, um, uh, whatever you want on this, like, unbreaking, it would not be better than this, you know why, because this, even though it's the same damage, and really you could do something that's, two damage and this that that would still be better because sharpness actually well i don't know about that but sharpness on an item makes it so you, now when you find a sharpness enchantment you can't use that on this because it already has max sharpness so you can't get this above three damage you can however 
maybe in the future I'm thinking of adding books so you can kind of enchant you know things that just give give you a you know better chance of surviving but on this not really do anything for you so and so far there's no uh, sharpness three so yeah I don't I don't know unless you get another iron shovel which I don't know if there is any um and then put like max sharpness or a higher sharpness on that which you wouldn't be able to do anyway so there's no really there, I mean it's sorry it's the flame digger you also have some nice stuff like a healing potion some food some arrows iron lapis really everything in this chest I, I really am enjoying this so far from uh you know this I do want to point out it looks stupid but that's okay it really is. Um. Yeah. Actually, I wanted to test something. Let's end up making this the entire thing. Can you stand on top of here? Wait. I don't understand that. Oh, I guess because it's like a full block. I don't know. I want to make them all uh, iron bars. Let me note that. Let me put that in my notes. Where's my uh, noter machine or a phone? Really just using this thing for notes. I don't really do much on it. Um, make the mid ruin. We're going to call it the mid ruin. Alright, that's nice. So that's that's one so far. Um, so that, bam, you have that. That took way too long, but uh next is we're gonna say that for last. We added shields. Um I wanna add one to this middle part. I was waiting for uh Oh, I guess there already is one, I forgot that I put that in there. So shield is now in the middle. That's the only one in the middle. As of right now, though, I want to say that. Um, but there's shields. There's obviously the shield. There's a shield in here. That's a lot of shields. Um, and on this guy, so that's cool. And most people don't know this, but you can take the armor from this guy, or even better yet, take sticks. No one really knows how to do that, but you can do that. It's if you're able to do that, you're in survival, not adventure. Even though most of the time I think it's in adventure, which we're gonna do that quick. Alright. So, added a small pond. Where was that? I think that was. Was it over here? Oh, right there. Uh, this, this is not like the pond in the original game. Why is that like that? I swear I changed that, but that's alright. That's alright. That's alright. But whatever. Actually, we're gonna do this. I gotta think smart, guys. I gotta think smart. Or the knee. If that's even possible, really. Bam. Now you got a diamond gapple. That's really good, actually. I don't know if that's gonna be too OP or not, but we'll see. Uh, last but not least, a new building has been added. This one I'm kind of skeptical, skeptical, skeptical about. However, I'm skeptical of it, but it's not in the way that you would think. I'm more skeptical because I don't know how well it's going to, like, match the game. It, nothing's really made of bones, quartz, and granite. Kind of, I thought that was direct, but I was like, no... And I like gray powder as the floor. Or I should say concrete powder because... Oh no, that's sand. That's right. So yeah, I guess I could use like red sand or whatever. I don't care. Um, we have a potion here. It's just a lingering harming because that's really good. Uh, lava bucket in there. Really useful. Um, and a...
that's not where was the fire aspect I don't know where I put that it's somewhere I'm super skeptical of it now oh wait some got added here what was it oh no that wasn't this one which one was it was it this one I think it was this one. I guess it's the only one left. Protection. That's what I added. Okay. What did I add? Where did I add the fire aspect, though? This is just power. Oh, you know what? Fire aspect. Alright. So, so far, this looks like an update that's going to change the game, but not as most people would think. I mean, the new building's cool. It doesn't really add too much, though. You have a way to cook food, which you can't really get raw food anyway, other than, like, some little parts. You get a lava bucket. You get a diamond. You get sharpness, too. That's all cool and stuff. Get a way to disenchant stuff. That's cool, I guess. Um, it's not really that big, though. I mean, I think there was a crafting table in here, was there not? See, there wasn't even a crafting table. I don't know. But, I mean, it's a good place. You get nice loot, but it's not really the best. The pond, I feel like, is going to change the game up a bit for, like, later game. You have a gaffle. You have a diamond. You know? Um... I think shields are going to change it the most. I really don't like shields. I think they're kind of boring and stupid, but... You know. What I want to do, though. Jack said about adding a graveyard, and I'm kind of, like, torn. I don't know what... Books, spawn eggs, are items that I want to add. Um... Let's see. Berry bushes? Like around the map? And like little patches or something? Would be neat. The worst place to put it is like, where was that? Right here. Right here. Going through. I know I already fa faxed it, patched it, but like somewhere like this where it's just like a one way. You can go this way. That's gonna just take you farther out around, and it's very narrow. I guess you could lose people in it or put a bucket of lava down, but... Here's some suggestions, okay? Suggestions. Alright, 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 Let's see. Suggestions for right now. Uh, change the thing to iron bars. Um, add maybe more potions. Books, ender pearls, question mark, definitely spawn eggs, elytras, I really do want to add those, but I don't know, maybe, and I just had that in my mind, what was it, come on, um, berry bushes, I forget. Oh, a nether portal. A way to go to the nether and uh, fix stuff. Or like mess around with stuff. Or do really whatever you want. There we go. I really want to add a nether portal. It would make the game so much better, and it would make the game more interesting. You have multiple dimensions to go through. I think 2.0, 3.0, um, maybe the Nether update where I add like almost a second map or something like that. 
Um, I don't know. 1.2, I mean, so far, it it's looking pretty nice. So, that that's kind of just my opinion on things. You could add mobs, just like, placed around the map, but I don't see the, uh, the need to. I want to actually check this. From what I did, you can get basically, yeah, you can get across the map. Actually, let's test this in survival. From sand, sort, sort of fire. You know. Survival. I bet if you had this open, you could get a nice running start. You can get to the village. That's overpowered. I would abuse that so much, dude. I would, I would just exploit it. I guess. It's a new one. I never used ever in this video, ever. But I want to hear your guys' opinions. What do you think about the update? What do you think about anything really? So, um, yeah. I do want to do like same thing as like 1.7. I think that was 1.7. That no, was that 1.6? I think it was 1.6. Where I like did a complete revamp of the uh, village, where there was like actually trees, foliage, you know, villagers. That's another thing, villagers. All right. Um, if you want to see gameplay of this, I want to try to get some maybe tonight. That would be amazing if we could do that. But, um, and there will be guides for pinnacle weapons. Oh, give me a second. Okay. Uh, pinnacle weapons, as I'm gonna call them, or named weapons. Whole guy. Whole guy. There's the, the chopper. Right there. There's the, uh. Obviously, sword of fire. I think there may have been one in here. So that's two. Obviously, three over there. Four. And, yeah, five. So. Five uh, pinnacle weapons. There definitely needs to be like a machete. Maybe a stone sword with. Let's see. One, two. Ooh, alright. This is. Uh, I. Uh, th this is too much to take in. Alright. I wanna. I wanna. Uh, pinnacle armor. Pinnacle armor, pinnacle bow, crossbow, where was the, um, oh, warrior sword, so yeah, we don't have a stone sword, a stone sword with maybe knockback one, and... Fire aspect one. I think knockback one and sharpness one. Might be the way to go. Wish there's more enchantments so we need something like that. I don't know. Has a slight chance to cause fire damage or like a really big attack. I don't know. I think something like that would be really cool. Um to add like a machete into the deep forest that would be awesome but yeah so we need pinnacle armor bow crossbow a machete that's four new pinnacle weapons maybe even a shield or something i don't think you can enchant shields but or like an elytra maybe one elytra can be added as like a a pinnacle weapon or a pinnacle armor piece 
That would be the only Elytra in the game, though. Or Elytra, I don't care. Um, that's about it, though. Thank you guys for watching. Oh, also, I want to add something, like, up here or something. That would basically be a second survival game map, or maybe, like, a parkour course or something. Where when people die, they would come up here. I want to do that. But, uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.